Well, it's been about eight years since a really good shooter game has come out. And I gotta say, I am absolutely pumped for this announcement. Battlefront 1 and 2 from 2004 and 2005 have been remastered. And it's getting released on March 13th, 2024. And there is going to be 64-man multiplayer servers. My birthday is coming up, and I couldn't have asked for a better fucking birthday present, let me tell you. These are two of my favorite games of all time. Battlefront 2 from 05 is still in my top 5 ever. This is such great news, not just for Star Wars fans, but for anybody that loves shooter games. And there really hasn't been a good shooter game released since 2016. Let me say that again. There has not been a good shooter game released since 2016 with Battlefield 1. And then the year before that in 2015 with the third Battlefront game that came out. As soon as I heard this news, I had to throw this commentary up. But I did have to pump the brakes for a second because I was so excited and then I thought to myself, wait a minute, wait a minute, EA is involved here, they're going to fuck everything up. And then I realized they're not the ones doing this remaster. And then it was all smiles again because we've actually got a chance to have a Battlefront game that EA and DICE can't fuck up. Worst case scenario, somebody else might fuck it up a little bit, but hey, it can't get any worse than EA from my point of view. For the first time in two decades, EA is not going to be working on a Battlefront game to screw everything up, or choosing to focus on the Battlefield games instead of making the Battlefront series a priority like they should have from the beginning. This is crazy to me. I, I was not expecting this when I woke up today. And if you guys want to pre-order this, it's called Star Wars Battlefront Classic Collection. Some of the details that are worth noting, there is going to be crossplay, but I think that it's going to be between Xbox One, the Series X, and the PlayStation 4 and the PS5. I don't think PC is in the pool, and obviously I'm hoping that it stays that way. Anyways, this remaster has been completely done from Aspire, who have done some great things in the past, including some of the best Star Wars games ever to be released a long time ago. For size on the Series X, it's about 57 gigs starting out. And also the original Battlefront 2, they are going to include all of the DLC content. For the original Battlefront game, there is going to be one bonus map with Jabba's Palace. There is going to be achievements, single player, co-op, along with the multiplayer that I already mentioned with the 64-man servers, and split screen. I have heard some people mention that the multiplayer is not going to launch that night or going into the early hours of the morning the first day that it comes out, but I'm alright with that because usually what happens with brand new games and multiplayers especially, when there's a lot of people that want to play it, the servers just usually end up crashing, so I can't confirm that, that's just what I've heard. But man, this is a kick-ass start to the year, let me tell you guys. I really have not been this pumped up since 2016 about a game. I was starting to think that the only game that I was going to have to look forward to this entire year was X Defiant. But that game has been pushed back. And a couple years ago, I, I was really excited for Insurgency Sandstorm and Crossfire X, but those just did not pan out the way I wanted them to along with pretty much every AAA titled shooter game in the past decade that's been released. But as long as there's no microtransactions on this, I'm thinking your boy here is going to have a huge comeback with the Battlefront series. And I know a lot of you guys will be excited for that, as you should be. Anyways, here's the official trailer with audio, and I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching the video, and I'll see you guys real soon. Simulation days are over, Trooper. This is a real battle. Right, move out. No retreats. Warm up. No excuses. Now get out there. Fight your way across the Star Wars galaxy in the classic Battlefront games with massive 64-player online battles and split-screen local gameplay. Fight with heroes. Never tell me the odds. And battle with villains. Bring me more 
Get ready for the Star Wars Battlefront Classic Collection. Launching March 14th. Pre-order now.